says our parents during their life, they gave uh, my four sisters a certain amount after selling their property. Nothing is given to sons from that. Now the inheritance is being shared as per Islamic law. Is it accepted in Islam or what is the solution? Fact number one, the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam commanded justice when it comes to giving valuable gifts to the children, sons and daughters. And the reference to that is in the hadith of an numan ibn Bashir, may Allah be pleased with him and his father, uh, whom his father decided to give him a property. And he went to the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam to ask him to witness the event. So the Messenger of Allah asked him, do you have other children than an numan He said, yes, I do. He said, and did you give each and every one of them similar to what you give to an numan He said, no, only to an numan So the Prophet ﷺ refused to witness such contract. And he said, find somebody else to witness that because فَإِنِّي لَا أَشْهَدُ عَلَى زُورِ This is falsehood. And he commanded in a straightforward command, اِعْدِلُوا بَيْنَ أَبْنَائِكُمْ You have to be equitable and just when it comes to dealing with your children, sons and daughters. So if it happens and a father gave one of his children a property, then he died, then during the inheritance, the inheritance will be divided and the person who's been given whatever during his parents or father's life will also get and receive his or her share of the inheritance. Because if the parent is blameworthy, if he was not fair, that is something different than dividing the inheritance. So that should have been corrected during the life of your parents. Sometimes the parent or the parents may give one of the children something extra or more than others for a legitimate reason. Like a child who is handicapped, a child who is not given much like the rest of the kids who are grown up and they, 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 they received a huge amount for the school tuitions, uh, international education, sending them overseas, getting married and buying them the furniture. So he allocates certain amount or a property for the child who did not receive a similar amount. That's fair. Okay. Barakallah